Hi, Brian. Hey, yeah, I am here. All right. Good. Let me, uh, can you see us or? Well, it hasn't come through yet. Sometimes it takes a couple of seconds. Yeah, all right. I can see myself, and that's a nice shot. All right. Let me see if I can, um, try to think what I have pushed here that's, um, let's see. Oh. <laughs> I was just on, we're, we're a little late because uh, Dean Shoresky uh, contact, contacted us from uh, Canada and we just had a quick talk to the class he's teaching up there. Oh, sure. So when, I got, so when I got off with him, my picture went away and now I'm trying to figure out what button I need to push to yeah. get us back. Okay. Well, whether it comes back or not. No, uh, we can have a have a quick chat of our own here. Um, sure. Why don't you go ahead and, and tell people who you are and where you are and what you do and. Sure, my name is Barry Dahl. I uh, work in higher ed, so Go I, ahead. Yeah, I. Uh, my name is Barry Dahl. I work in higher ed in Minnesota okay. at Lake Superior College. Here? Yeah, you're not hearing me. Uh, we worked up for a second. There we are. Okay. Are you able to hear me now? Yes. All right, I'll start over. My name is Barry Dahl, and I work in Minnesota at Lake Superior College. So I'm in charge of all things technology here. And um, I've been a Skype user for quite a while, and we have several people on our campus who do use it as well. Um, it's just a, it's, it's another way to connect. Um, I don't actually like using the regular telephone very much because I get so many salespeople who call me. The, on here, I know who's calling me, and they typically... Uh, you know, there are people on my list who I want to hear from, so, so that's a plus. Um, the fact that it's free and kind of fun isn't all bad either. Um, you know, I, I don't know what Dean might have talked about. I'll just tell you one, one other thing. Uh, well, one thing that's also kind of cool about it is that you can, uh, you can use a chat or instant message tool. I'll, um, I'll go ahead and just send you one right now that, you know, for example, has... Uh, has my blog address on it, uh, so you're able to send text, text chat as well as the uh, audio, and you can do that even if you're not um, talking to the person. I, I oftentimes get little text messages through Skype from uh, other people, maybe just seeing if I'm in my office or if you know, do I have five minutes to chat or something like that. Um, but I'll, I'll just tell you, I two two other kind of quick things that that have been interesting with it. One is uh, they, they also have something called a Skype cast. Have you talked about Skype cast there at all? We haven't yet. I've been in them before, but go ahead and tell us what they are. Well, you know, I, it, it's a way that you can connect one to many. So I've hosted a couple of Skype casts with uh, faculty here. Sometimes it's just college faculty, but they don't all come to the building. Some of them work at home. And then also um, throughout the whole state of Minnesota, I've hosted a couple of Skype casts. Excuse me, my other phone is ringing, but I'm going to ignore that. Um, but it hosted uh, a Skype cast with faculty from all over the state of Minnesota who called in on particular topics. Um, you can give the mic over to anybody that you want to, and so uh, it's kind of a moderated um, voice um, message. The one thing you don't have yet with the Skype cast is the video opportunity, but um, you can have up to 100 people, I believe, in, in an audio call. I think I've had as many as 25 at one time. So that's kind of cool. It's a free audio conference sort of thing. And the other thing I'll just mention real quickly, and I know that I don't want to take up much of your time, is one of the coolest things that happened to me with Skype. This summer on my blog, if you go to my blog, you'll see that I have a little uh, chat widget on there. It's a little Mebo chat widget. And I was sitting at home this summer um, late, late at night, and I got a little chat message from somebody who I didn't recognize and just said, you know, are you available to talk for a, for a few minutes? And I said, what for? And he said, about e-learning and that type of thing. So I said, sure. I said, can, I, can you Skype me? And he, he did. And so this guy was, is working in India. He's actually an Australian who's working in India in, in e-learning. And we had about a one-hour Skype um, conversation um, just all about all things e-learning. And that was just something kind of out of the blue where he, he was able to contact me and we were able to talk for an hour for free uh, across the world. So that was pretty cool. Pretty good. Nice examples for us. That's great. Well, Barry, um, 
Barry, thanks a lot for doing this for me. You're welcome. Sure appreciate it, and uh, we're going to be doing some digital video stuff here tonight. Sounds like fun. All right, so again, thank you very much. All right, have a great time. Thanks. Thank you. Uh, Bye-bye. Bye-bye.